because it's your birthday today. It is my birthday. What's happening? What's happening? What's going on? You gotta walk the off the chain. Yeah, it off is the off the chain, chain in it's here. It's off the easy for she's. Yeah. <laughs> so I found out in doing my little research on uh -huh. you today that uh, you're from a town in Texas I've never heard of. Uh, that I was, in, I lived in a town that no one had heard really? of. Where really? Are you, you're from Terrell. I'm from Terrell, Texas. Terrell. <laughs> No. Y'all ain't from Terrell. They haven't. They're just Texas. Terrell, it's, small, it's, right, next to, it's right next to Dallas, about 20, 28 miles oh. east of Dallas. It's the gateway to the east. Uh-huh. About 12,247. Well, I'm here now. Uh-huh. So. Yeah, yeah your, your town was bigger than mine. Atlanta, Texas is where Atlanta, I live. Okay. And that's Atlanta. southeast, and it was 5,000 people. Wow, wow. Yeah. And you made it out. Yeah. It's great. Yeah. It's great. No, I mean, you, you, small towns. No, small towns, crazy. they grow up, and they... they yeah. I, but I moved there when I was in high school. But, right, okay. But anyway... Yeah. But uh, so anyway, it, it's good to see you because uh, you you really are. I, I said at the front of the show, you're so talented. Thanks, thanks. You are so so talented. Now, what you started it, doing stand up? I, I came to, I came to San Diego to in music first. I was like, oh, really? Classical piano scholarship in San Diego, if, if you can, if you can believe that. Yeah. So so but. The thing is, is that I was so amazed at California. You know, coming from Texas, you don't see the beach. You know? yeah. I was at the beach every day. I, th I think my grade point average was like 0.08. Uh -huh. yeah. And they were like, you know, what are you doing? I said, man, I'm just at the beach. I'm yeah. picking it. And uh, then I came up to LA and started doing like, the, you know, the, the amateur night uh -huh. on, on Monday nights. And somebody dared me to go up and I went up. And at that time, Monday night in LA was like all the gangsters and the, you know, the, the thugs was in the audience because it was like their night. It was like, you know, free drinks or whatever like that. And I'll never forget going up, <laughs> going up as, as Cosby, but as if I was a gangster. I said, I was rolling in the hood and off the heads of the shizzle, my niggas, all this stuff. <laughs> and it's like, that's how I got started. And then from there, it was just like every night I would go up on Monday night, they would expect me and, and that's where it started. So you had been doing impressions even yeah. while you were in school uh, playing piano. You, yeah. you were funny, obviously. Yeah. And, yeah. and what other impressions did you well, do? Well, Mike Tyson, how we boxing champion. Uh -huh. nice. And I think at that time, Ronald Reagan was in. There wasn't a lot of brothers doing Ronald Reagan. Yeah. At that time, <laughs> and it was like, well, 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 as a matter of fact, I, I go, ho, ho, ho. You know, so that, you know, that was the thing. Yeah. 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 They get it all that yeah. way. Uh, They will be with it in a second. They'll, I know, be, they'll I know, be tight I know, and down with it. Tight? With, with the fizzizzy. With the, <laughs> with the fizzizzy. I don't know what that means. I've Look never, at the brother going, I don't I've know what never that understood is. the. <laughs> fizzizzy, that means physician. Does it? Yeah. I've never understood the whole Snoop Dogg For, talk. Well, it's like this it's house. Uh huh. Hizzle. Uh huh. Or hizzy. Uh huh. Or his nouse. His nouse? For sure. Fizzizzle. For sheezy, oh. for shizzle, uh -huh. or for shiggity. <laughs> you, you are so talented. You're such mm. a brilliant, brilliant mm. actor. Thank and you. and then you see you sing and you and you write songs and you're just you're, yeah, 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 you're yeah. so talented. Thank you so much. You're so talented. You. And now uh, you're spending a lot of time on eBay, and I'm very impressed by by. Uh, She's gonna bust me out. Really smart. No, tell tell people okay, what, what you're happened? doing. Okay, I'm embarrassed, but what happened was is that. <laughs> Okay, since I got the Oscar, I got to use it a little bit. I, I, was, I was trying to sell this Bentley that I had. It was like a 96 big yellow Bentley, and I went, took it to the guy, and he was like, I can't give you any money for this ugly yellow Bentley. And I, I said, man, do you not know whose Bentley this is, man? You don't watch, you don't watch cable? You haven't seen it? He said, I don't care. So I put it on eBay, and I put Jamie Foxx Academy Award winner, <laughs> and with a picture of me like this. <laughs> And, and, and it sold for like $150,000. So, there's some parts, you know. And only I, only I could do it. You won't see Denzel or Halle doing that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's like, because I'm a comic, you know, at the end of the day, still. But then you, you sold a house like that, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I, the, my house in Vegas, I wouldn't, you know, because it didn't appreciate where I bought. Everybody's house was appreciating all over the place in Vegas. I bought it for $100 or something worth a million now. I'm like, man, 
So, but where I was, it didn't appreciate. So I just, you know, it wasn't. A, it wasn't. The picture wasn't as big though. When I put it on eBay, you, you put know. a smaller picture of yourself. Smaller picture, maybe I like see. this. <laughs> the thing about Jamie, you know, the, the thing I love about Jamie Foxx is that when he comes on the show, it doesn't stop when we stop for commercial. He continues to go all the way through the commercial. It's the best vibe. It's uh, so great, man. Well, so we, great. we love you. All right, so tell me about the 40th. When are you going to be 40? December? 40, December 13th, Sagittarius in the house. All right. Uh, we're going to do it all. What are you going to do? Uh, where is it going to be? What happens? We're going to go all over the globe. We're coming door to door. Uh -huh. We're going to get a bus. I'm coming to you. Yeah. You and Ludacris are going to go all Me around the world. Me and Luda. Around the world. Uh -huh. <laughs> all right. All right. But uh, I'm just going to go nuts. I mean, it's four, I'm going to drink 40 ounces. Everything is 40. Everything's 40. Everything is 40. And I'm going to do a New Jack City thing because that's my favorite movie. Oh. And so I'm doing like Wesley Snipes. I'm going to be Nino Brown. Uh, anybody? I guess not. N New Jack City? Yeah. Because he just had the greatest lines in that movie. <laughs> See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. So. <laughs> That's got to come back. Cancel that girl. I'll buy me another one. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to do that whole thing. I'm going to get an electric blue suit on and no shirt and a mohawk and the whole nine. I'm going all out. That's See great. See me, Texas. <laughs> All of a sudden. And, and where is this going to be? I don't know. No? I don't know. No, I'm going uh, to start in LA. Uh huh. And then I'm going to get to Miami. Okay. Because I got to get that pump, 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 pump. I got to get that, you know, yeah. a little bit of that salsa. Uh huh. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, they're with you. <laughs> the best, the best. Number one song for 12 weeks in a row. That yeah. is, that's, uh, congratulations Thank on that. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. To the fans. And that video. All to the fans. I'm working out and I'm watching that video and I see Ron Howard and Jake Gyllenhaal and Forrest Whitaker and. The way it happened, mm -hmm. we were at the inauguration. Uh huh. I, and everybody was hyped and it was just so much love going on and we were watching Barack do his thing. If there's any indication <laughs> that uh, America. It's not the most incredible country in the world. <laughs> and everybody's just like all into the Barack, you know, feeling and everything. And then I looked over to Ron Howard. I said, I'm shooting a music video. Would you love to be in it? He said, sure, man. Uh, uh, black people are cool right now, man. Right now. Between, between you and Barack, man, sure, man. We hugged each other. We was hugging each other. Mm. <laughs> Got to singing Kumbaya and all kinds of things, man. And then I went over to, uh, to, 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 to Forrest Whitaker and I said, Ron Howard said he's going to be in my video. <laughs> so don't let the white man outdo you. So you got to make sure Good. that we stick together, brother. You know what I'm saying, brother? Good. So, so Jake Gyllenhaal, I told him that Ron Howard was going to be. Ladies, give it up, Jake Gyllenhaal. Yeah. Okay, yeah. That was, that was a little bit difficult of a sale because I kept telling him that Ron Howard is coming. I said, Jamie, listen, you don't have to lie to me. Uh, if you want me to come do the video, because he wasn't at the inauguration. If you want me to come do the video, I'll just come. He said, but you don't have to tell me Ron Howard is coming. And then next thing you know, Ron Howard comes, Samuel Jackson, uh, 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 Quincy Jones, uh, uh, Clarence Avine, and a whole host of other people. And it was just a love fest. God, I know. It's a cool video. It's shot beautifully, yeah, too. Yeah. Really, really cool. Yeah, but we wanted, to, we wanted to take this sort of, this was an urban, this was really like an urban, really ghetto song. I mean, we're talking about blaming on the alcohol. <laughs> Jamie's probably, you're probably in a good mood because it's your birthday today. It is my birthday. Go, 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 go. Oh, it's your birthday. If it's my birthday, it's your birthday. Yeah. Now. Sagittarius. Yes, Sagittarius. Yeah. That's a good sign, I suppose. The best. I mean, we yeah. get along with everybody. You yeah. know what I'm saying? It's like, uh, yeah, like Zodiac Spackle. Uh -huh. I get along with everybody. <laughs> Zodiac Spackle. Yeah. <laughs> and now, what, 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 what are you, you? What are you? Aquarius. Oh, nice. I'm next month. February 15th? No. Okay. What is it? January 26th. Okay, because my daughter's February 15th. That's, yeah. good, that's and, a good sign. And she's Aquarius? Yeah, Aquarius. And Oprah's Aquarius, too. I know. And Porsche is Aquarius, Who, too. Who, Porsche? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Yeah. Aquarius. Yes. That's beautiful. Yeah. Who I'm you? a Sag. Yeah. And, <laughs> and what will you do to celebrate your birthday? Man, everything. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get arrested. I want to get arrested. I just want to... I just want to get
Get my keys, get my keys. Get, don't let him take my car. <laughs> I celebrate all month. Do you do that? All month. <laughs> it'll, be, it'll be January 13th. I'll be like, it's my birthday. Yeah. You should celebrate. Well, I, I celebrate that, that you're on this earth because you bring us so much joy. So I, I'm great. happy that you do celebrate well, for a month. To, we need to throw a big party, yeah. man. We're, we're neighbors now, but we haven't seen each other yet in our neck of the woods. But uh, and, and what will you be? You'll be hanging out there? I'll be at the crib, mm -hmm. chilling. Uh-huh. Uh, but you know, it's like, I've been trying to get with you. I got, you know, we got horse rides set up and everything like that. And, uh, and so I heard I someone gave you a horse for your birthday. Yeah, that's, that's really L.A. That's some uh -huh. L.A. stuff. I mean, <laughs> Who gave you know, you like living in Des Moines, you just, I mean, well, maybe you do. But, uh, but like, somebody, my, my management gave me a horse. But first, they gave me a, they, they tricked me. They gave me a Shetland pony uh -huh. at first. <laughs> And they said, well, you got, your, cute. Yeah, you got your 40 acres, and here's your mule. I was like, hey, come on, man. <laughs> and, uh, and then they brought the horse out, which was crazy, because, you know, for, for, like, the opposite sex, the girl's like, oh, my God, you got a horse? That's crazy. <laughs> because everybody else getting, like, cakes, and I'm getting, like, thoroughbreds. It was crazy. And it, was that your first horse that you ever owned? Yeah, yeah, because I'm from Texas, but I really didn't. Yeah, what? Shout out, man. All the... <laughs> but... <laughs> anyway, uh... <laughs> Why do we do that when we say so, when people know where you're from? You're, you the, only, you're oh, no. the only one who does it. I've, okay. I, I've, <laughs> I've never gone to New Orleans. Nee, 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 you know. uh, so Five we, oh, okay. so <laughs> That's right. Uh, so, so you get a horse and it. And you get a horse, but I didn't really ride though. Mm -hmm. I, didn't, I didn't know how to. I didn't know how. Well, I didn't know how to ride that well. And but being from Texas, everybody thought I did. And I was like, I ain't getting on a horse. I something might happen. I might get thrown in the street or something like that. I don't know how to do that. But then some girls got on the, you know, pretty girls on the horses over one day, and they're like, "You gonna get on?" I was like, "Yeah." Did you give somebody a horse for for a you gift? You know what? I did. Did uh, you anybody give... know who uh, the young man Robert Downey Jr. is? Robert Downey Jr. in the building. I saw that on Letterman. He talked about it. Yeah, man. You know why? Because I, I worked with Robert, and just before uh, Iron Man came out, he's like, "Dude, I just want to get a house." When he finally gets a house, and he was showing me his house, and he says, "Look at all my stables, my empty stables, my empty stables." So for his birthday party, I hosted his birthday party. It was, you know, everybody was there, you know. And uh, Gary Shantlin grabs a mic and, and does some jokes. And like, Jamie, uh, watch this. And he did these jokes. And I was like, well, I'm, he said, he said I, you can't follow me. That's what he was saying. I said, well, I'm so going to follow yes. you. Yes. <laughs> because I, 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 I got up and I said, uh, first of all, Robert, happy birthday. And doggone you for playing a black guy in a movie. <laughs> as, as hard as it is for brothers to get parts out there. <laughs> Doggone you. Doggone. I didn't say that at the party, right. but I'll say right now, uh, doggone you. Uh -huh. As tough as the struggle is, I just got the chains uh -huh. off of my, anyway. Uh, uh, <laughs> wow. that's, that's a show on BET, wow. anyway. Uh, uh, <laughs> no, but I told him, I said, but you are an honorary black guy because you did go to jail for a minute, and, uh... <laughs> So you still got some, you know, you got the black in you. And uh, uh, what, what I said was, but now that you have your 40 acres, here's your mule. And we brought up a nice, beautiful horse. And I looked at Gary Shetland and said, I'm killing you right now. And then after we brought his horse up, and I said, since your wife really, she really cares for him in a, in a deep way, we bought her horse too. So we got them both horses. That's a very expensive gift for you and for them. Yeah. Yeah, that's a yeah, commitment. Yeah, yeah, that is. That's a commitment. That's great. Just to let you know, Portia's birthday is in January and she's looking for a new horse. We have to take a break. <laughs> we'll be right back with Jamie Foxx. I'm exhausted. It's over. So I have to. I, it's, Give it up. You got the best show. This is. She got the best show. Uh, she got the best show. All of my, my, my daughter loves. Everybody loves. You got the best show. Best crowd. Uh, okay. yeah. You're sweet. You're sweet. I, I have to come to one of your parties because this is what you're like. Just uh, in the middle of the day, uh, having fun. Yeah, and I have, I have certain times uh -huh. for my party, like from seven to eleven. One nice, kind. Nice, nice. And then? And then, then we, we change over from 11 to 12, and it, then... From, and then it changes. Yeah, from 12 to 6, we centers and things I like see. That. All right. I have, I have a question or two for you. Yeah. Sir? Yes. Um, are you still on your way to my party? 
You know what? So let me let me just tell I, you. I haven't talked to you since this. Uh, we Portia and I had a joint birthday party in January, and we live down the street from each other. And we and we get a call at about yes. three o'clock. The party was from one till six in the afternoon. I am wild, and so. <laughs> So yeah. about 3 o'clock in the afternoon, and he literally lives, if two minutes away, like down the street, and we get a call from his assistant, Jamie's on his way, announcing you, like, oh, Jamie's on his way. <laughs> so, so we're no, like... We didn't uh, know. So, it wasn't like that. It was it, like, I wanted to know if they were still... Yes. Because I was trying to finish yeah. the little stuff that, so, the so it's now, stuff that was frivolous that right, I was doing. Right. And I don't know why I missed, so, but I, I So it was you. 3 o'clock, and we get the call. Yeah. You live two minutes away. Then it was six o'clock, then it was seven o'clock, then it was eight o'clock. At nine o'clock, we went, should we close the gates? Because we had <laughs> we had the gates open. We were like, and everyone had left, but there were a couple of people still hanging out. And I was like, and so I just was wondering, are you still on your way? Um, I apologize. What happened? I, I, some family stuff. You know what? I li my house is ghetto. I don't know if you... See, I moved my whole family into my house. Uh -huh. So there is always a ch things that I have to make sure are right before I leave. Because mm -hmm. my mother and my father, well, my biological mother lives there, and my stepfather lives there also. In but that they, place. In the same place. Uh -huh. But they've been divorced for 18 years. <laughs> so you can imagine she's on one side, he's on the other uh -huh. side. And every time he has a date, it gets a little weird at the crib. <laughs> Because she ends up on his side getting some out of the refrigerator. Just like, oh, I just need to get some out of the Oh, hey, how are you? <laughs> I'm Louise, honey, the original honey. <laughs> right. So my house is, you got to come to my house. I, I, uh, I you keep you. saying that. I'm going to just show up one day. You should. And, and get the... ready for the, if it was a, re if I had a reality show, blow everybody out of the water. <laughs> We usually play a game, uh, uh, right. Celebrity, but I'm just going to hold them up, and I'm going to try to guess who it is just by you doing their impression, okay? Okay. All right. If there's any indication that uh, America is not the most incredible country in the world... Obama. <laughs> I just like to hear you do so. But, um, uh, so first of all, have we, have we boxing champion? <laughs> a lot of times, I, I, I like to hit people in the nose and push the nose up into the brain before... <laughs> Mike Tyson. <laughs> Wow. Uh, 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 well. <laughs> Ronald well. Reagan, really? <laughs> <laughs> you know, the filth to fly in the floor <laughs> because the people, and I just can't take it because, you know, no, 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 no. Hey, you know what? I, I'm going to make you do what you do, man. <laughs> Georgia. <laughs> So the last time I saw you, uh, uh, Portia and I, uh, as we've said before, we're neighbors with Jamie, and yeah. I thought we lived closer than we do. <laughs> uh, Portia and I decided to, to ride our bikes to Jamie's house. Yeah, and, and I told I was like, yo, you sure you want to do that? Yo, no, I'm fine. I'll, I'll be fine, Jamie. And I started cool, and then I said, well, my, my driveway's a little steep. She said, I'm, I'll be great. We ride all the time. <laughs> you know, we're used to riding. We'll just ride on up. And all right, cool. So I'm sitting there waiting. I'm like, man, it's been a while. <laughs> and I get a call saying, Jamie, uh, could you come get us? <laughs> <laughs> I was, I was at the bottom. Just, we lost in the thicket. I was like, <laughs> I was starting to send Lassie for you. It sounded oh that God. desperate. Like, Lassie, go find oh. Ellen. We, we made it inside the gates, and then the driveway is so we just We just threw our, we didn't even care. We were going to buy new bikes. We just threw them away. <laughs> And we were like, can you please come get us? We, are, we didn't yeah. even walk. It was that steep. We didn't want to walk it up your driveway. It was crazy. And then when I got there, it was like, you know, falcons and crows right. flying over there. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I said, man. You live? They was like, it's Ellen down here. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> You guys are partying in here. We are partying in here. You party like, I mean, you guys are partying like it's a club, and then there's a show. It's an afterthought. It's an afterthought. <laughs> and it's funny because you guys don't see, but I can see all of you guys dancing in the back, and it's crazy. I <laughs> But it was, where's, where's the black lake? Right there in the red. I think it was you. What I notice about black women, they don't want to get too out there. You know what I'm saying? And she, you, black women tuck their lips in like, mm. <laughs> You want to, or they poke their lips out. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. 
crazy. Uh, I, oh. I'm just happy to have you here because I just sit back when you come out and I just let you go. That's, that's, <laughs> you're, you're like my favorite guest. Oh, man, You thanks, really thanks. are. It's, and, a, it's a blast. And I'm so happy. I have to thank you. Uh, I, I give him a hard time because we live near each other, and yeah. I invite him to our parties. Uh, we have very few parties, but... Um, you, you finally came to my uh, to sure our party, did. so and thank you for dope, coming. Man, you were the last one to show up, but it was great. It was <laughs> it was kind of over, but, yeah, but you, you know, made it. Because I, it's, I go on, you know, I hate to say black people time, but <laughs> no, I hate to say that, but I I think it's true. I just like I'm on my way, and then yeah. all this other kind of stuff happens, and the next thing you know, but I'm late. Uh, all this other stuff, ha you live down the street. You literally live. <laughs> I would it's say, hard I, to explain when I you just say, Afri African American things happen. You know? I know. I don't need, I'd I don't like know to know what they are. Like, because what, I you, what you mean he got shot? No, I'll be there in a second. No, I, I said I'll be there in a second. I gotta get down to Ellen's. <laughs> Dog, well, well, how much bail money is it? How much bail money is it? Okay, then I'll get down to it. It's just be crazy. Like, it's just, I understand and the next thing now. Yeah, you look up and uh, now I you're understand. out of money, your cousin is shot. It's crazy. It's black, it's black <laughs> stuff that's Hilarious. happening. I cannot explain it. It's crazy. Hilarious. Uh, and then I don't want to bring the wrong people to your crib, because they're, hey, Fox, hey, you going to Ellen's, right? Yeah, I'm going. You're not going. Because uh -huh. some of my friends don't have um, social security numbers. Let's just say I that. see, I see. <laughs> <laughs> well, we check all that at the door anyway. Because you remember I had a situation. Mm -hmm. Remember a guy I introduced you to, and he ended up not being with, he's in mandatory college right now. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. They still haven't figured it out, man. Yeah. No, they got man, it. Y'all got to get some hood friends, they got man. It. Yeah. Where did you spend? Uh, did you have a fabulous New Year's Eve? I imagine you did. Right there on the road, like everybody else, didn't get where I needed to go. Where? What? You know what how, where you, were you? I was in I was in Miami, but it was like we planned wrong. We'll go here at seven. Then we're gonna do this at nine. Then we're gonna go here for two hours, and it's eleven fifty nine, and we in the in the street. <laughs> I said, come on, man. We just jumped out. Ten, nine, eight. Just start hugging everybody. Hey, I, I, I missed the whole thing. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I'm going to count it down right now. Ten, nine, nine eight, eight, seven, seven six, six, five, five four, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You lost your I mind. I lost my yeah. mind. Yeah, they got very excited. Yeah, it got on. Why did I act like that? I don't, I don't know. know. I turned into Eddie Murphy. Eddie Murphy, Eddie Murphy. I... <laughs> so wait, I have to ask you a question yeah. because I heard in, uh, we were talking about uh, you in the meeting this morning, yeah. and they said that you were trying to lose weight. That cannot be true. Six months ago, I was in trouble. I was in dire straits. No. Yeah, because I was, I, you know how you, you know how you think I'm going to just work out? and work it off, so mm -hmm. I'm gonna eat a yak, and <laughs> <laughs> I'm eating eat a yak with extra cheese, some uh -huh. mutton, I was eating everything. Bring the mutton! Uh and next thing you know, my belly got wrong. And <laughs> it got wrong, but you know how since you know, you're a celebrity, people don't really tell you, even your trainer don't even wanna say like, yo, your belly's wrong. Uh -huh. And then you don't tell, you get fame face. You ever see when somebody get a little, you know, when I wasn't making money, you know, I was, I was this, then you get a little money in it. It'd yeah. be like, <laughs> so, so about six months ago, I had a little situation, and then somebody took a picture of me while I was clowning and sent it and said, yo, you need to get your life right. And so... Yes, that's not... But, but look, look, I'm actually on the phone with my trainer, like, brother, you fired. Yeah. But, but now, but now, but now, you know. Uh-huh.
Now you look good. Yes, you really do look great, and I'm sure you don't mind, or do you mind if I say how old you just turned? I'm, I'm 49. 49, 49, and you look... Yeah. You look great. You look great, too. But I'm much older than you. You're 49, I'm, I'm 40. But you know, like, like when I'm out, people don't know I'm that old, because my, daughter my daughter's like, Dad, will you catch up to your age and stop acting like a little kid? <laughs> And like I'll be like, like you know, I hang out with Kanye, I hang out with with Drake, or I hang out with these young guys, and I, sometimes I DJ the clubs like in Vegas or whatever. So they think I'm a lot younger than I am. And I remember seeing these these you know the girls at the DJ booth and they talking like Jamie, hey, I said hey, how old are you? Like oh, we're 21 and she's 22 and she's ancient, she's 27. And I'm like, <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> and then she said, well, well, how old are you? When I told that girl how old I was. You would have thought that I told her I had a terminal disease the way she was. <laughs> I said, well, I'm 49. She says, oh, my God. <laughs> oh my God, can't you, can't you die from 49? <laughs> Girls, come on, let's pray for him. He has 49. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my so, God. Yeah. How did this work? How, how long have you all known each other, and how did this work out? It's, it's a great show, by the way. It's great. Thank you so yeah. much, Ellen. Um, so, I met Jamie in 2012. Um, he was hosting SNL, and he said, hey, man, I'm a big fan. I think you're amazing. I think you're talented. <laughs> and you know, what the fizzle, what the fizzle? I'm gonna work with you in some capacity <laughs> and way. And then, <laughs> like, we just, we got up. I said, no, I like it. Jamie Foxx, Jamie Foxx has got the best laugh in the world. Ha <laughs> ha, that's hilarious. That's hilarious. <laughs> So, I mean, you know, this has been like a fun journey and finally finding the project to collab with him on has been... It's and been are crazy. you hanging out? What's he like as a friend? I've oh. only ridden my bike to his house once. Oh, and, uh, <laughs> but I... That was crazy. Jamie, yeah. Jamie yeah. Foxx is... Jamie Foxx turns up all the time, you know. He's always turned up, like, you know, hits you up. Like, uh, hey, man, what you doing? I'm like, uh, well, I'm at a funeral. Oh, that's cool. I'm about to bring uh, Leonardo DiCaprio and Odell Beckham through. You like, I don't think that they want to be at the funeral, dog. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't think they gonna like that. You know what I mean? He's always ready to party, whatever. I, I know I'm hard to hang out with because he's so good at doing impressions, so that's all I do is just all, all night. Just like, yo, what's up with Jay-Z, man? Where, where is Jay-Z at? And I'll be like, you know, Hove is cool, you know? Hove is dead, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yo, 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 man, yo, man, where Kevin Hart at? Listen, Jamie, swear to God, uh, first of all, it's not type of, you know, publicity I need right now, because <laughs> I'm going through stuff, people, you know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> what would Chris Rock have oh, to say about on, that? come on, Jamie. You know what? I don't know. I mean, I cheated too. <laughs> I mean, I was... <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I don't apologize, maybe make an album. I don't know what you <laughs> How great is that? It's, it's crazy. fantastic. The two of you, are, I, I mean, well, we're going to do this a little later, because both of y'all are going to do impressions <laughs> later. We're going to play a game. And I will pick one. And uh, it's Barack Obama and Beyonce. And uh, you're at Please a nude be. beach. I guess... <laughs> I guess, uh... I, I guess since you do Barack so good, I guess I have to be uh, Beyonce. <laughs> OK. All right. Ah, uh, well, you know, I've been, uh, I've been observing, uh, I've been observing that booty for a long time. I would tell you Jay-Z is very lucky, but, I mean, you can't say no to the presidential package, so, uh... <laughs> so, uh, what I need you to do is, uh, you know, uh, take it off, and, uh... <laughs> Uh, I'll put a Nuvo ring on it. I don't know. 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 Whatever. Whatever. Stop. <laughs> All right. Stop. All right. Pharrell Williams and Ryan Seacrest, and you're on a haunted hayride. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> hey, that's a ghost. Ho! <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Everybody, get up now! 
Dallas. Put it up. Everybody. Pickle Jason. We'll be right back with another episode of the Haunted Hayride. Okay, okay, I like that. I like that. All right. Okay. Oprah oh. and Jay Z, and you're selling Girl Scout cookies. <laughs> I guess since you do Jay Z so well, I guess I have to be Oprah. <laughs> All right, cool. <laughs> I mean, Yo, buy the damn cookies. <laughs> it come up. Yeah. Cookies! Everyone get the cookies! <laughs> Everyone get the cookies! Cookies! Everyone look underneath your seats and get the cookies! <laughs> cookies! You know, if they look under the seats, they're probably gonna get a copy of 444. <laughs> <laughs> Four forty-four. <laughs> All right, this is the last one. Kanye West and Kanye West buying a used car. <laughs> you know that that. <laughs> um, that that car ain't you you. Nah, because I don't like how what? it's how it look. Huh, huh. And don't I? You know, listen, this ain't even a hold on, fam, because <laughs> because look. This is the real. What we not gonna do is, you know, you ain't gonna put me in no full focus. That's not gonna happen, fam. <laughs> and also, fam. All right. Out the West. My mother celebrated her 77th birthday. <laughs> you know. On a yacht. Yeah, we 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 actually we actually took a yacht in Miami. You know, uh, 305. Uh, 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 Jr. and. Uh, and Lauren Ridinger, they let us, you know, come on their yacht, which is, you know, it's great to be on the boat. My sister didn't want to get on the boat because, you know, I'm not saying it's cultural, but you know, boats and black people, so I don't know, it's, it's different sometimes. <laughs> so she didn't want to get on the boat, but it was a, it was a nice yacht. Mm -hmm. It was dope. Yeah. So uh, you're on the boat. You're 52 now, and there's some video of you doing some uh, pull-ups or something. You look good. Oh yeah. You, oh, you, uh, look out look now. Look at that. Get come on. it. Get it. That's ah. That's and, impressive. Yeah, that was yeah, but you know, see, but it's only the top. See, so you know, because brothers, I, I'm saying 2020, I got to do legs. I don't ever do legs, because you know, brothers don't do legs. Really? No, no, no. Like we're big at the top and sort of small at the bottom. Like I could beat you up, but I can't chase you because. Uh <laughs> I'm like you know, I'm like this. <laughs> Cause I don't, I don't do, I don't do leg. I, I do brothers do. I don't see a lot of black guys doing legs. And I did legs one time in 2019, and I took one of those uh, female squat classes, a butt burn, of where y'all are just all day just. Yeah. And I couldn't, I couldn't, I couldn't. You're gonna my, be sore tomorrow from that. Yeah. Yeah. Cause my cat, I don't have calves. Yeah. So that's a, you know, that's I think that's part of my heritage. But you. Whatever you're doing, meaning you, you from look... Africa, we have smaller calves. I want to one day, one day. I'm African American. I'm American up here, and I'm African down here. I would have done well, man. Oh my God! I did calves one time, and the next morning I got out of bed like, oh my God. <laughs> Who's your favorite celebrity to do an impression of, and let's see it. I do the impersonation when Jay-Z was at my house, and no one knew who he was, and we were throwing a party for Puff. And I said, hey, man, aren't you? He said, yeah, it's a nice party. It's crazy. <laughs> it's like this all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Jigga! Uh, <sighs> <sighs> it's been actually not hot, but I was just doing yeah. a, like an acting. You're like, so good at yes, acting. You know, it looked like it was hot. Anyway, anyway. You make me ha you make me happy every time you're here. You've been here. This is your 20th appearance, by the what? way. What? Yeah. Um, 
Some people say 20th. I like to say 20. 20. Yeah. That's, that's Spanish, guys. Yeah. Duerme con los angelitos, negritos. OK. Wow. Duerme con los angelitos, negritos, porque todavía no existe. When did you learn Spanish? I just learned that earlier. Uh, <laughs> when did you learn? That means sleep with the little black angels, for they exist. Portia is learning Spanish right now. Is that right? Yeah. Portia? I, I thought you, she was over here. No, you, I don't know why you did that. <laughs> Portia, like, hey, Portia. Yeah. Okay, she's not. Okay, it's no, the coffee. But anyway, um, so 20th appearance, I need to know a uh, favorite memory from, do you have a favorite memory from here? My memory was your birthday when I came down those steps and we was turning up. Uh, blame it on, oh, there it is. Yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, hey. Hey! You surprised me. Yeah, we surprised yeah. Come on, give it up. Come on, you can. I'm going to tell you, my favorite memory is the very first uh, season, 2004. Whoa. Um, and take a look at us. But you sat down at the keyboard and surprised me, as you do all the oh, time, man. and did a rendition of our theme song. But wow. look at this. First of all, give it up for Ellen today, please. <laughs> What? I do remember. Get up, get up, let's give a little love to Ella. <laughs> Didn't you just have a birthday? I did just have a birthday. What did you turn? I turned 25 times two. Congratulations. I got yeah. it. Here we go, guys. Right. Here we go. All right. Ellen! 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 <laughs> to a wonderful person, a wonderful artist, there is no age. You are pure, pure beauty. Toast to you. So are you. Thank you and happy birthday. Thank you. I love you. Happy birthday to you. Thank you, Thank you for being here. Come on, come I love on. you. Jamie Foxx.